In this episode, we're going to introduce the setting of thermal camera. First, we need to add the camera on NVR. This thermal camera is a dual lens camera, which means that add this camera online would take two channels. When adding the camera, we should use the same IP address and different remote ID. Now, let's access to the camera setting page. First part, let's configure the local parameters. Under local parameters thermal imaging, enable firebox and show temperature info. Then the detection box and temperature information would be able to show on the live view. Second part, let's configure the fire detection. For detection mode, you can choose between fire detection or smoking detection. When enabled, fire detection boxes will be overlaid on video images. If there is certain area which would cause false alarms on site, please use the shield area function to avoid it. Now, let's move to the trigger action. You can set up the trigger alarm output and alarm sound here. And also the audio, repeat and blink time. Now, let's move to the third part. Configure temperature detection. You can choose between Celsius and Fahrenheit. When enabled the show temperature gradient bar. The highest and lowest temperatures will be displayed in lines. The tracking highest and lowest temperature is used for showing the pixel with the highest and the lowest temperature. The overlay temperature on snapshot function will enable or disable temperature information overlay on video images. Then, let's draw the detection rules. There are up to 12 detections rules can be configured. The measured temperatures would be compared with the set threshold value. And we can manually change the threshold from minus 20 degrees Celsius to 150 degrees Celsius. If there's a deviation, we can use the measurement accuracy to calibrate. Duration here means the duration of the temperature or the change of the temperature. After setting up two rules, we can use the comparison rule now. When monitoring two similar areas at the same time, you can detect abnormal temperatures in one area by comparing the temperatures. Also, under the trigger action, we can set up the trigger alarm sound and light for temperature detection. Now, the final step is to enable the function on NVR. Before the setting, please make sure your NVR supports the thermal imaging function. Under Smart Setting, enable the fire detection, smoke detection function, or temperature detection you set up. And under the trigger action, you can set up the trigger recording for it. Remember to click on save to make sure the configurations are all set.